And welcome back. It's been 10 years since the SARS epidemic erupted into public consciousness. The disease killed at least 700 people and infected thousands of others. It seems like the anniversary is being marked by yet another potentially deadly disease. 10 years ago, SARS became known to the world. 8,000 people in two dozen countries were infected, with an official death toll of 774. Now a new virus is beginning to spread, and this Hong Kong researcher has been called in to help contain it. Yuan Kwok Yun was one of the first to identify the SARS coronavirus back in 2003. As have been demonstrated for in the case of SARS, the virus actually mutated very rapidly. Within actually a few months, the, the virus changed very rapidly and can adapt uh, to very different situations in terms of animal host and in terms of transmissibility. So I think it is very important that we should be vigilant, but not worrying or panicking. That is not going to help. The new virus is called novel coronavirus. So far, it's killed 9 out of 15 people infected. Cases have already been recorded in the UK and parts of the Middle East. And as with SARS, the concern is that in a modern world connected by international travel and business, it could spread fast. Professor Kwok Yun goes through samples of the virus. It comes from the same family as SARS and the common cold. In Hong Kong, the terror of SARS is still fresh in people's memory. It killed 299 people, schools were suspended, and the virus even triggered evacuations.